Hey, what's up guys? Hope you're having a good day. I have a really awesome freebie from Rick Ellis today. My friend Rick has created a lot of freebies for us over the years and today he's giving us this building generator. It's a really, really awesome rig. Uh, it comes with three presets, a tall, medium, and small building, and then it also has a bunch of different uh, front faces for the building. So you can either use these presets or else you can build your own. Um, they're pretty modular, so if, let's say, well, let's take this middle building, the firehouse, you'll notice that there are some segments that are turned off. So if we want to take this segment and turn it on, you can see that we have another modular piece and we can just slide that wherever we want it so we can extend the building up. Let's uh, uncheck segment three and we'll pull that one up as well. All right, so now let's say that we wanna to top this off with uh, this crown right here. We'll just duplicate the crown and we'll drag it up to the top. And just like that, we've made the building taller and kind of customized it a little bit. We can even add a crown and drop it down here if we wanted to. All right, so another thing we can do is change the front. Right now it's the firehouse. You can see that we have this main entrance right here. So we also have these other ones laying in front here. So let's say that we wanna change out um, this blank wall and put that one in here. So what we're gonna do is just drag that blank wall into the main entrance and we're gonna hit reset PSR and that's gonna put it right in the same spot. Then we can just drag it out and turn off that main entrance and now we have a different uh, front face. And if you don't want that firehouse thing, we'll just go to that frame and turn that off. So there you go, now we have a blank wall. If we wanna add this one, um, let's see, main entrance one, we'll drop that into blank wall, reset the PSR, drag it out and we'll turn off the blank wall. And now we have that kind of front face and we can also drag that back and forth depending on where you want it. So a little bit inset, all right. And finally we have fire escapes on the sides which are really nice. So we can see them right here. If you don't want those, just click on it, hover over your object manager and hit S and it'll pull it up. Here it is, fire escape and we'll just turn that off. And that's a quick way to get rid of that. So that's it. It's pretty simple, uh, really easy to use and fun to play around with. Make sure to thank Rick Ellis. He's a stand-up guy and you can find him over at rickdellis.com. Uh, make sure to hit him up in that contact form and send him a thank you note. Super generous of him. And uh, I hope that you find good use of it. As always, thank you for checking out the Pixel Lab. We'll talk to you next time. Bye, everybody.